I bought a triple pedal for the Yamaha DGX670. I can use the auxiliary input as a sustain and the triple pedal to control drums on and off. It would be nice to do a fill with the other two pedals of the triple pedal. A fill or an ending or an intro or a break. But it seems that the left pedal and the middle pedal seem to do the same thing. I press the direct access button with my left hand, then I press the right pedal. Up comes that. Then you go to, let's say, select style start stop. And I touch it with my right foot onto the right pedal. And what else will we do? So there I'm using my right foot on the right pedal to start and stop it. Really, that's worth it just to get the triple pedal to do that. Because I want to have sustain whilst I play piano. Now I'm going to press the direct access button and the middle pedal. This allows me to select something else. And I'm going to select... Fill self. Now I'll press. Now I'll press the direct access button and the left pedal, and I will select break. Now I'm going to do the start stop with the right pedal, and then I'll try to do change it up with a break and a fill self. So here is. By the way, when I started the uh, start-stop with the right pedal, it came in with a fill. Now I'll do it again, and it will not have a fill this time. Not sure why. Now I'll do whatever the middle pedal was supposed to do. It gives a little fill, but now I'm going to just hold down the middle pedal. And I'll let go. That's a nice break. Now I'll try the far left pedal. It is the break. So I'll press the direct access button. And then while holding that down, I'm going to press the right pedal. It shows you. Yes, I selected style, start, stop. Now I'm gonna press the direct access pedal and press the middle pedal. It says fill self. Then I'll, I mean, <laughs> press the direct access button and touch the left pedal. And it says fill break. But what it's doing is, it is only doing whatever you assign to the left pedal. You, when you select, when you press the middle pedal, it's only doing what you selected for the left pedal. Although, let's, I'm going to press the direct access button with my left hand. Then with my foot, I'm going to select the middle pedal. Now I'm going to select glide up. And watch this. When I press the middle pedal, it will glide up what I play on the keyboard, but it will also play the break. It's weird. First, I'll start it with my right foot on the right pedal, starting the style start stop. Okay, that's the right pedal to start stop. Now I'll press, now I'll play something on the keyboard. And that note, I'm going to glide up, so I'll press the middle pedal. Now I'm going to press the left pedal. So the left pedal is not gliding up what the middle pedal is functioning as, but when you press the middle pedal, 
I, I just stopped it with my right foot on the right pedal. But when you press the middle pedal, it will do the glide up, but it also triggers the brake. Am I going to return the unit? No. I, I love the start-stop. That's what it's all about if I'm doing some live stuff or recording. I would love the control of start-stop with my foot for a gazillion different drum machines and other keyboards. I have done that. I've loved the function of start-stop with a foot pedal. Just letting you know, something's a little strange there. So you get two functions as far as what my needs are, the drum uh, start-stop and maybe a break or a self-fill, fill self. <laughs> I hope this helped you. It's uh, like $89 for this triple pedal. And I believe the Yamaha triple pedal, which is not portable, is like a hundred bucks. Bye.